but it's, it's interesting, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, go for it, Dad. <laughs> it's like the slippery slope of zoop. <laughs> I, I wouldn't trade my beard for anything. <laughs> I think like subconscious pressure to do it. So I started doing it. Hey guys and girls, it's Kathy Cat, your flashy fashion reporter. And today we're gonna go hit the streets of Tokyo and ask the foreigners here what they're thinking about the men's hair removal commercials that are currently all over town. Let's go and ask. What? Another thing I find interesting when I go on the trains now in Tokyo is there's a lot of commercials for hair removal. Not on top of your head, but for guys, it's um, hair removal salons for their beards as well. But recently they're promoting it also for guys to get completely hair removal everywhere. Thoughts? You're, ni you're nodding there. No, I haven't seen it yet, but it's, it's interesting. <laughs> I don't know. Like, is it like a trend now? I think it's girls set the standard. All girls generally have shaven like arms and such. Mm. And now it's also going over to the boys. So if you look around, especially in summer, the boys will have shaven arms, shaven legs. Wow. I mean, I don't think it's necessary actually, but if it if they like it, why not? It's okay. <laughs> Quite a lot of work to mm. have like everything removed all the time and I think it's just annoying. So <laughs> why would you do that? Like <laughs> nah, it's just work. Yep. Those hair removal salons can also get quite expensive. Mm. Some people leave up to thousands of dollars at those thoughts. Mm. Would do that. <laughs> I wouldn't do it either. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I have blonde hair, so it doesn't matter. You can see it anyway. Uh, yeah. Yes, that's the yeah. advantage. Yeah, it is. Jealous! <laughs> <laughs> I think it's cool. Yeah. The females have to do it, it's a boy's turn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They'll know our pain. Yeah. <laughs> Great, let's go! <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't really judge people on their hair body, so... It's fine by me, either way. <laughs> Beards, yes or no? Uh, sometimes yes, sometimes no. Whoa. Little moustache, great. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How hairy are the boys in the Netherlands? How hairy? <laughs> <laughs> More hairy in the Netherlands? I don't know. I don't know. I've never seen... But yeah. I think maybe in Eastern Europe it's yeah, maybe yeah, more yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. In, in Europe, Eastern Europe, they're yeah. hairy. Yeah. So if your dad decided to come do a complete hair removal, <laughs> what would you agree? Uh, yeah, it's his body. I don't make choices about his body. So yeah, go for it, dad. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 dad. Great idea. I actually, I've been trying to get my husband to go to one. Mm -hmm. He's so scared that they hurt. I was like, no, I promise you, the lady told me it's pain-free and I do it too. It's pain-free. He's like, nah, I gotta think about it. But I think it's a good idea. Why not? Yeah, go together next time. Yeah, right. There's a couple's hair removal. Wow, it's a new thing, right? <laughs> Take him by the hand. It's like, we're both today. We're both going to go and get hair removal. Couple selfie. <laughs> good. Good. good I think. Less, less smelly. <laughs> less sweating, less smelly. I think it's. I mean, but then if you like it, if you yeah. like hair, then have hair. Yeah. Whatever is your personal preference. Yeah. How is that back home in Australia? A lot of guys shave. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird, but I like it. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird, but you like it. It's weird, but I like it. Yeah. Because it's like, oh, what's that? But yeah. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Same thing. Everyone should just do what they want to do. But yeah, that's pretty funny that they're advertising that. I know, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love cool. Japan. Yeah, we love Japan. Mm, I think hair removal is just getting a little bit, uh, it's more common now, you know, it's not just for the girls, it's for the men because the men want to look good too, right? Mm -hmm. So, you know, they have like uh, options now that's for men and it's kind of, it's kind of good because like the more the options available, then more people will be willing to try out the hair removal services. I got a Boisillium wax just like <laughs> <laughs> just like one, with, one month ago, and you know what? Oh. It felt great during the during that time. It felt terrible, like it was painful, but it was actually a bet. I did it because I lost a bet, and after doing that, I'll definitely do it again. Yeah, oh. I actually I'm a big avid fan of it. When you when you wipe and you go right between, it's like it's like the slippery slope. Goes zoop. <laughs> My God. Maybe like a dolphin. Yeah. Like a dolphin. Yeah, like a dolphin. A slippery. It's like a raging water. A slip and slide. In the middle of summer, best thing ever. Yay! So give me a second. Okay. Um. Uh, I wouldn't get it myself. Um, I'm not really into that look for myself. Think it would be weird, but um, if you're into that, I guess yeah, go for it. Pretty much the same. I, I wouldn't trade my beard for anything. <laughs> But it might also be because without a beard, I look like 12 years old, so. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you like Same. no trading in the beard? Nope. 
but also like arm hair or something just has to be there. <laughs> has to be there, why? I don't know, it's just natural, yeah. You said it's your beard, how about your beard? I look below 16 if I've got no beard, so uh. that's kind of a problem. I would be uh, asked for my ID everywhere I go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And I may not look like it, but I'm 25, so uh, <laughs> that would be kind of embarrassing. Boys, full body hair removal, thoughts? Uh, I think it would suit Japanese guys really well, but it would be weird on European guys. Okay. It would just look weird, like if I had to look at the two of them without any hair, it would just be, it wouldn't suit them at all. <laughs> but for Japanese guys, I think it's kind of like, it fits the image. Like it fits the J-pop image, maybe. Ah, the idols, the idols. Mm, I see. Um, if you want to, do it. If you don't want to, don't do it. Mm -hmm. I know it's a very, very big trend in Japan to like very, be like pretty much hairless. Yep, dolphin. <laughs> yeah, dolphin, like a dolphin. Yeah, 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 very much so. So um, I will say like since moving here, I have started shaving my arms. Ooh. Only because like... You felt the pressure? I, I felt a little, a little pressure. Mm. Plus I honestly like I have tattoos. So I thought it made, well, it makes my tattoos look better, number one. But also like that kind of pressure to do it because I look around and like other Japanese guys don't have any arm hair. Mm -hmm. So I think like subconscious pressure to do it. So I started doing it, but then I kind of like it. So I'm- ooh, so are they shaved now or not? Yes, they are, yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay. Yeah, so you can see, yeah. Very, ooh, ooh dolphin smooth, <laughs> dolphin smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of hair removal salons not now in Japan, like legs, uh, arms, all of that. Hair removal salons. Hey, oh, <laughs> you're catching it. Sure, yeah. If it makes you happy, yeah, go for it. <laughs> I prefer hairy man, so... <laughs> no, different women. Can you imagine him without the beard no, and without the arm hair? I'd rather keep it, rather keep yeah. it yeah, I've, sure. I've shaved his body before and it was a big mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing the razor and huge mistake yeah. here. Oh, and then you just had cuts all over yeah, your so body. I'm, say I'm completely against it, yeah, <laughs> absolutely not. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Hmm, this is a very cultural issue and whoa, it seems like especially in cultures where it's important for the man to be strong, manly and muscular, those cultures seem to support more that if they're hairy, it seems to be part of the deal. Strong, manly, muscular, her, her, that kind of look. But here in Japan, where uh, the culture is a little bit different, that kind of beauty and aesthetics and being just cleanly shaven, seiketsukan, is so much more important here to the ladies and gents. So it's interesting how this is very a cultural questions, I would say, as such. You're making me dizzy with that director. If you're curious about more what foreigners in Japan have experienced, check out this video next. Hit that like to give us that support. And if you're one of our members, thank you so much for supporting our channel. We need you, so thank you for being there for us too. Thank you.